When you think of the best weapon mods in Doom Eternal, I assure you the last thing on your mind is the remote detonation mod for your rocket launcher. Uh, unless you're someone with an absurd fascination with being underneath mayonnaise, regardless of your culinary tastes, I seriously doubt that the vast majority of the Doom Eternal's player base is using this weapon mod. When it's Chad, older brother, the lock-on rockets exist. The name's Fusa, and today I wanted to create a demon that would rectify this issue I've found ever so apparent within Doom. I present to you, the Malformed Chimera. An entangled mess of demons past held together in a thick, viscous goo, the Malformed Chimera is a scavenger on the Hellscorch battlefields, finding and consuming parts of fallen brethren, a living collection of the dead if you will. It'll take the form of the three most recently killed demons, leading to some interesting combinations. I'll share two of my own in the attacks part of the video. But depending on what three demons it decides to take hold of, you could have a very threatening beast on your hands. Since it can mimic one attack from three separate demons, it will have a variety of moves making this demon something new to fight each time, separating it from every other. The first encounter could be parts of an imp and a dread knight, and the next could be pain elemental and a carcass. It's very formal change to accommodate these new parts, and thus only the goo is its true form. You'll be able to hunt them down as soon as they spawn to find the malformed chimera in just its goo form, waiting to latch onto a demon after it dies. They're passive in this state, cannot attack the slayer, and instead they'll flee from him. So if you're quick and precise, you can destroy it without any threats. To defeat it, the slayer will have to think outside the box and use unconventional tactics. Since it's a bit of a pace breaker to be forced to use a particular weapon or weapon mod like in the case of the spirit from the Ancient Gods DLC, there'll be a few options to defeat the malformed chimera. You can fire a rocket into the goo that holds the demon together and then activate the remote detonation mod to instantly kill it from within. Or you can freeze the demon using an ice grenade and shatter it into a million pieces, just like the uh, T1 1000 from Terminator 2. No two battles are the same, so keep a keen eye out for any recognizable parts on the malformed chimera, as it may be able to give you an edge in battle. Due to the unique nature of the malformed chimera, the attacks and movesets that it will possess varies depending on what demon's limbs are currently within its hold, so I'll give you a few examples of some interesting combinations I thought of. However, the bulk of the moveset will be left up to you to create in the comments below, because I just know you've got some crazy combinations to share. Pinky, Imp, and Baron of Hell. It would gain the ability to dash, just like the Pinky, climb up walls and throw fire like the Imp, and come crashing down to the ground to create a small AoE fire slam attack, just like the Baron of Hell. Despite being a fodder class demon because of how easy it is to kill, this is a good example of how not to underestimate it. Another example is the Cacodemon, Whiplash, and Pain Elemental. It would gain the ability to float above the ground like a Cacodemon, extend chains from its arms to, and then set those chains on fire to try and hit you at range like the Whiplash, and summon Lost Souls just like the Pain Elemental would. This combination turns it into a dangerous demon to deal with while it's in the air, but still has one fatal flaw, being ever so weak to the remote detonation weapon mod. I wanted the malformed chimera to act as Doom Eternal's one piece of randomness. That is, if you don't count the three Mimic Demon videos that I did a little while back. I just love how intricate the battles in Doom Eternal are sometimes, and with certain demon combinations working together, everything just gels in a really nice way. But once you play the game through enough, you learn these patterns, and everything slowly begins to feel like a repeat of something you did before, which is hard to circumvent when the game is designed around killing demons. So this is where my uncanny obsession with the randomness elements comes into play, like the Mimic Demons mentioned before, or the Malformed Chimera itself. I thought of another way I could make this demon work. Instead of it being more of a natural demon, it'd be more mechanized and have a mixed moveset from likely the super heavy tier demons. But I decided not to go with that concept and went with this one instead, as it didn't fit in with the randomness element I was going for. But if you'd like to see that, a more fixated, less random Chimera of sorts, um, let me know in the comments and <laughs> I guess I'll, I'll make it. <laughs> As mentioned before, I'd love to hear what demon combos you can all create in the comments below. I'll be sure to pin the best one, so get creative. Thanks for watching to the end, by the way. Hopefully you didn't skip through either. YouTube is really mean to me if you do. Uh, <laughs> either way, please support me and this channel by doing the usual necessities if you like the idea. I appreciate it as always. The name is Fusa and by all means, stay creative.